Hello, everybody. I just thought that would make for a better intro than me just standing here. So, welcome to the first, uh, what am I calling this? Visual journal. Entry number one. Today, I know Lucy really wanted to have like a reset day and she really wanted to juice, which isn't necessarily my version of a reset, but she kind of wants to do that. So let's go juicing today. I do like juice. Eh, I'll save my opinions for later. Let's just get this day started. I got everything we need for juicing. Also, why does it look like I have a toupee on? Juicing supplies are quite heavy. A little sweaty. They pretty much had everything that we needed from TJ's, but they did not have turmeric. So I'm gonna go to a different grocery store to get that. What'd you make? I'm just eating your chicken with some sriracha and mayo. Huh. You're eating something a lot better. You wanna show them? I made kind of like a fake Greek salad. Not fake, that looks great. But there's no like, feta and there's no tomato. So Are there any nuts in it? No, you can have a bite. It's really good, very fresh, very summer. I feel like we're we're getting into our summer era. Oh, it's really good. Want more? Need more. Do you see this, folks? Sharing is caring. Sure. But while I eat, let's get some inspiration for these juices, okay? right now so when I got off the elevator I was like is this even my floor? I looked around I really like had an existential crisis I was like I don't think I live on the floor okay but like why does this turmeric look like little beef? also turmeric's a lot cheaper than I thought I would have guessed this was $20 I know oh my god four fifty six. I, I feel like we used to at the farmer's market pay $4 for like one For nub. like one of them. A little number. Yeah. You know what? Oh my god. I think that turmeric that we used to buy at the farmer's market was like aged. It was like a hundred year old. Yeah, hundred year old turmeric. What does that mean though? I don't know. Was it literally a hundred? roots a hundred years or? I don't know. Maybe like it had been a turmeric plant for a hundred years. Maybe it's like a dog that's like hypoallergenic. Similar. about to have turmeric juice up in here. It still makes me a little nervous. Should I take off my sweatshirt? Take off the pump cover, am I right, ladies? We haven't used this. Oh, it's like sticky. We haven't used it since we moved from California a year ago. It's just, we have such a small sink and it's so hard to wash, so we just haven't done it. I just feel like I'm missing the part of myself that thrived in California and made homemade sourdough every week, juiced every week. I just feel like I was in my fresh era. So we're gonna get back into it. Okay, everything's ready. I just need to chop off the, chop off the booty of these celeries. I think I'm gonna make a celery ginger lemon one, kind of like a green juice one, and then I'll do a carrot orange turmeric one.
Oh my gosh. Wait, Chino, you tried it without me. Wait, I thought you just tried it. I, oh, you're right, I did. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. So good. So good. How much do you think that'd be worth at like a press juicery? 100 bucks? $7,500, yeah. $7,500? $7,500. All right, go juice yourself. Hey there. Ooh, sunny. Um, I'll stay over here. So originally in this video, I was going to be making some desserts because we we're gonna go to a friend's house tonight for some drinks and desserts and they ended up bailing on us, which is totally fine. But I thought it'd be fun to make a chapter about what happens when our plans fall through. So tonight, because we're not gonna be with our friends, Lucy is grabbing some Thai food. We have not had Thai food in a sec, so I am excited for that. And we're gonna watch one of our favorite TV shows, it has an episode out that we have yet to watch. And I think we're just gonna kinda have a chiller night tonight. So chill nights are good too. I kinda want some more of that juice. Let's get some juice. Look how bright that is. It's so cool. I've had such a sweet tooth today. I've had half a cookie, some bonbons. And I think I'm craving this just because I want sugar. Honey, I'm home. How'd it go? Lucy just had an audition. An audition! And she got a call back almost immediately, which is pretty unusual, right? They've Let's... kind of been running them like that recently at some of these non union theaters. They have everyone in the group go. So it's like 10, 15 people. And then you have to wait in the waiting room. And then the monitor comes back in with the headshots of the people they want to keep. Oh. So everyone knows who didn't get a call back, too. Oh. So, like in the group before me, only two people did. In my group, Six people did. And you wouldn't know what that's like to not be called back, would no, you? No, I do. I'm I've... just kidding. <laughs> but she's crushing it, y'all. Lucy's crushing it. So proud of Lou. Yeah, wait, something's off. Yeah, pause it. Lucy and I finished our TV show, which... <laughs> that was such a cute update. Um, some of y'all know Succession is on its last and final season, which is crazy. Devastating. It is so intense. So good. Even though people may have bailed on us, we're gonna go for a little sunset walk. This is like your favorite thing. It is my favorite thing. I'm mm -hmm. honestly kind of surprised that you're coming. Well, I just, I'm coming because I know it's your favorite thing. Thank you. Love you. kind of justified tonight. What's the temp, if you had to guess? I would say 53, 52. It's, it's getting a little cold again. <laughs> such a nice walk, good idea. So Lucy, yeah. how do you stay inspired with all these auditions that you're doing? That's a good question. And kind of a perfect segue into tonight. I think always reminding yourself of why you love what you do and kind of the end goal as well. And like luckily in the field that I'm in, in performance and musical theater, the dream is so easy to go see. You can constantly remind yourself of that. That's true, I've never thought about that. A lot of other jobs you can't like yeah, go visit the CEO of a business. Exactly. <laughs> the amount of inspiration that comes when I see other like performers and artists and people just doing their job so excellently, it inspires me so much mm -hmm. to work harder. And then also just like, I mean, 
If you're an actor watching this, then you've heard this before, but people are always just like, it's called a play for a reason, like play, right. you know? Just to remind yourself of the fun of it rather than like it being so serious because it's so high stakes, it's so much rejection. For those of you who aren't actors, it's like literally doing a job interview up to 10 times a week sometimes and getting rejected from all of them. It's so vulnerable showing like your raw self mm -hmm. and then just waiting for approval. Tonight we're gonna go see Hades town to get some inspiration. We have not seen this musical and honestly I don't know the show all that well. I definitely don't know the story. I know it's about like Greek mythology. Do you know? Do you I don't know. know. I, I've listened to the music but I and I know the story from like high school class mm -hmm. but um. High school? This came out in high school? No 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 the Greek myth. Oh sorry I just the, yeah, listening. so the Greek myth came out in high school. And then we're going to see it with two of our best friends here, Cynthia and Brad. You've seen them before. This but... is their favorite show. We snagged $50 tickets. Mm -hmm. Hopefully we have good seats. We'll see. Yeah, I guess that is sometimes 50-50. We always look out though. But we always are sitting two of us. Mm, what about four. when it's four of us? Everything is alright Take me back there 